Here we are in the IVF lab, and today we're going to look and see how we biopsy an embryo for PGTA testing, pre-implantation genetic testing and mucoity screening. In our facility, we call it CCS, Comprehensive Chromosomal Screening. So now here, if you look over here, we have an embryo. Here is the holding pipette, and this side of the embryo is called the inner cell mass, and that will eventually become the baby. Over here is the trophy ectoderm, and that will eventually become the placenta. So we're gonna biopsy a few of the trophy ectoderm cells. Um, and in theory, the trophy ectoderm and the embryo have the same genetic makeup. So we're not taking cells off the inner cell mass. And now she's using the laser, that's the red dot, and uh, broke up a few of the cells, and now she's gonna slowly aspirate a few of the trophy ectoderm cells into this pipette. And now she has a few of the cells in the pipette. She's gonna use a tearing motion and with the laser, the red dot, just kind of snip out uh, a few of the cells, therefore releasing the embryo away from the portion that she's biopsied. And so we're gonna send off the trophectoderm cells for the CCS or PGTA testing. That is testing embryos for things like Down syndrome, Turner syndrome, trisomy 16, trisomy 18, monosomy X, these are genetic causes of miscarriage or failed implantation. By testing the embryo ahead of time and knowing that we have a euploid embryo, that is one that tests normal on the PGTA testing, we can improve the chances of a woman conceiving.